Hello, this is Nick from Laptop Media, and today we will show you how to open the Dell Latitude 147440. To open this device, you have to undo eight captive Phillips head screws. Next, lift the bottom panel in one of the hinge zones to create a small gap between the base and the plate. Then, you can start the prying process from there with a thin plastic tool. The safest way is to pry the sides first, then the front and the back side should be last. Please remember, it would be of great help to us if you just hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. That would motivate us to make even more and better videos for you. This machine has the optional 57 watt hour battery. The default version is a 38 watt hour variant. To remove it, detach the connector from the motherboard and undo the four Phillips head screws that secure the model to the chassis. The optional unit lasts for 14 hours and 17 minutes of web browsing or 11 hours and 7 minutes of video playback. That's a respectable result considering the modest capacity. To achieve that, you have to apply the balanced preset in the Windows Power and Battery menu and select the optimized power plan in the BIOS. Sadly, the memory is soldered. On the bright side, the maximum possible capacity is 32 gigabytes of LPDDR5, 4800 megahertz RAM in dual channel mode, which sounds future proof. At least we can have a sneak peek at the memory chips. The section on the left of the cooling is dedicated to the optional W1 slot for LTE or 5G connectivity. Our laptop lacks this feature. For storage, there is just one M.2 slot compatible with 2230 Gen 4 SSDs. The pre-installed NVMe is protected by a metal shroud that has a thin thermal pad on the inside. The cooling is simple, but it seems enough for an iGPU-only device. It has one large fan, a top-mounted heat sink, a thick heat pipe, and a heat spreader. 